What's going on guys? Recently we were sent over um, some goodies by Wow Stuff, which is uh, they, they make some licensed Harry Potter uh, merch and stuff like that. Uh, so we were actually sent over this three things. Um, this little keychain, which is a um, uh, sorting hat and you hit a little button and he uh, sorts you into your into your house. Yeah, there's a couple different modes on this, and um, we got two other things. Uh, I'm gonna save the best one for last, even though the other thing is this little uh, this little guy here, the the Tom Riddle diary, with which was funny because it came with this little Slytherin uh, Slytherin uh, little marker, which is just a green marker, which it's not technically green because it it's invisible ink. So you can actually write in here, and then they gave you a little hairy wand with a um, with a little uh, illuminating tip, which is it's actually a UV a UV light. Um, so what it'll do is it'll make this white ink or whatever. I don't know. It's not really. I guess it's ink. Um, light up. I don't know if you guys can see that it's lighting up, but it lights up green. So here you go. We got that, and then we light it up, and it turns, turns green. See, as you can see, there's nothing written on here. But when you revealio it, wait, where is it? There it is. What? Uh, it is pretty cool, and I'm sure that you can get other um, inks out there that may be uh, that may also be revealed under uh, a black light, because that's basically what the, this UV light is. It's just a black light, um, but it is pretty, it is pretty cool. I really like the quality of this. I like the fact that it's like a flexible notebook as opposed to like a hard notebook. Um, it, it may, it kind of feels flimsy at first, but um, it is, it is really nice. And it's just kind of like, it feels more old school, you know, like a, a nice, simple, flexible notebook that you could just kind of put in a bag, not really worry about it too much. It does also have these little metal, uh, metal corners here. Um, I believe that, both of these products are available uh, right as of right now. So these are definitely pretty cool. I, I think that they're very, you know, this is kind of just a dumb little gimmicky thing, but I'm sure that this will make a good little gift. Uh, this is really cool. I may keep this for like drawing stuff in, um, just with regular pencil and, and stuff, um, because it's just a, a cool little notebook. Or I may just keep it as a prop. Do you have to bother me every time I'm recording something? What do you want? You want to come up here? Is that what's going on? Yeah. Okay, yeah. You just keep pawing me. That's not really going to help you at all. What? What do you want? No, now you're on this side. If I lift up my arm. Okay. Now I'm going to have cat fur all over myself. Anyway, um, this is pretty cool. I like it. Link, you like it too? All right, I'll take that as a yes. I like it. The last cool product that we got was <clears throat> was uh, this guy right here. If you guys recognize this, it's a uh, it's a invisibility cloak. And this is the big product that's coming out um, in the beginning of July. At least it's it's like pre-orders basically for it or in the beginning of July. We don't get any sort of kickback, but they did send this out to us for free. Um, so this, I'm just gonna kind of go over it with you and show you guys uh, how to use it and um, and how it works. And maybe if I feel like it at the end, I'll kind of go over um, other ways that you can use it uh, without the uh, the thing. It, it is it is very um, like it's pretty ingenious though it's a it's a good gimmicky thing and uh, it's pretty much the same technology or the, it's the same way that they used uh, they did it in the movies so it's pretty cool um, how it works the first thing you have to do for it is download the Wow Stuff app which um, that's the main thing what I've noticed is that's the main thing that you're paying for when you do buy it um, and then also the the cloak itself because it has this cool uh, wizardy pattern on one side and the other side is a um, a green somewhat plasticky cloth on the other side or not cloth um material it's like almost like a plasticky you can hear it 
you know this side is more like uh very soft and uh and nice um but this side is a little bit more reflective-y. As you guessed, because this is green, um, this side's the invisible side and this side is the visible side. The app is what does the magic. The app is what makes everything really work well. Um, because without the app, it you just have a green cloth. Um, so that being said, you can buy a green cloth and use it with this app and have like a double-sided um, green material that will make you invisible. I'm gonna be showing you guys this on two different cameras. So this is the main camera where we're using the camera and the other one I'm gonna be using um, my phone and therefore going over it with you guys and you know, showing you what you do on the phone. You're gonna get a special code with the uh, the actual cloak and then that's how you, you're able to register the uh, the app and and actually get into it so you can't just go and download the app for free because you, I mean you can but you won't be able to register so you won't be able to access this part of it so the way it works is you go into it and it gives you the option to uh, to choose the invisibility cloak and then once you're in it you basically just flip the thing around if you want to look at yourself this way so you, you know you guys can see what I see now um, and the main the the hardest part about it is because the uh, is the the hardest thing about it is that the camera has to stay perfectly still. Um, if the camera moves at all, then you have to you have to reset, because what it's doing is it's taking a picture of the background and then it's keying out, which basically means um, getting rid of green things. So if you have a green shirt on, your green shirt is going to be an invisibility shirt. Um, so yeah, you can have some fun with that with the app. You can do weird stuff like that. Uh, basically anything green will basically be keyed out and you'll be able to see the picture that's behind it. So uh, you can definitely have some weird, do some weird fun stuff with that. Um, but you can also do that on a on software like um, something as simple as, uh, as iMovie. And if you guys want me to do a separate video on how to like make an invisibility cloak and you know make a video about it uh, i'm sure there's a, already a couple out there but i can i can definitely do it if you guys are interested in that leave a comment down below if you want to see that um but let's play around with this for a second all right so the first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to get out of the way of this shot so that um, i can get the background in the shot and then uh, i'll show you guys what i'm talking about but first i'm going to move this a little bit over here more so that it's kind of like in the same orientation as you guys. The the cloak comes with a, a little stand. I'll show you guys it in a second, but right now we're using it. Um, it comes with a little stand and it's a little flimsy. So when you go to hit the button, just make sure you gently tap it. Cause if you like hit it really hard, the whole phone will move. And then the, the image that it takes for your, your invisibility is gonna be um, obscured by the, uh, well, that's a weird like shadow behind me. Look at that. Um, It'll be obscured by the uh, by the thing. So if we look at this, we uh, we have a normal normal cloak. But if we flip it around, what is happening? Look, it looks normal on this camera, but then when we go back to this one, it's like, what's happening here? Um, but yeah, so we have the, the see. This is the thing with the chair. See, I'm moving the chair, but it's not moving behind me. Um, but if I stand up. So I may look silly right now. I look like I'm wearing a muumuu or something. Uh, but I think I look pretty cool down here. All I'm saying. So I, I had to change a couple of things because the way that the uh, the iPhone works and the way that my main camera work are a little bit different. So I had to make it a little bit darker because you can see I'm still kind of blown out a little bit here. Um, because this is the, the app, the iPhone app that we're going to use right now. And... Um, it's gonna look a little bit different than my, this is my main camera, this is the iPhone. So it's gonna be a little different. I think it's pretty great um, how it works. And you could definitely do the uh, the floating head thing where, you know, you're just, <laughs> you can see the chairs covered. <laughs> What's hanging back there? Oh, that's the cloak itself, okay. All right, come on, give me, get off, get off of it. There it is, okay. Um, so, all right. So you can definitely have a bunch of fun with this. Um, as you can see, in real life, it looks pretty silly. You don't wanna walk around like this. But in the app, it looks pretty awesome. Um, it does it does a pretty good job of like cloaking you um, and you know, like it's a real invisibility cloak. So yeah, the way it works is it'll basically take any green 
for the most part, there's a, a few shades of green. As you can see, it's just this is just some green powder that I have. Um, uh, but if you look at it on here, it looks, um, you know, it makes me disappear. So you buy the invisibility cloak, right? Um, but you don't have to use the invisibility cloak itself. The app is like the magic part. I think that the app is really what you're buying when you do it because you could do weird stuff like um, like this. This is a Puffs, uh, what is it called? Tissue box. And you could see that it's green. So if we look at it on here, it's also green. So you can definitely have some fun, weird, play around with some weird stuff and, uh, and make yourself invisible. Would I recommend this thing? Um, if you can afford it, I would say yes. It's a cool toy. You can have a bunch of fun with the app. The app is the thing that you're buying. The app is the most, the most fun that you can have with this thing. The cloak itself, it's all right. Um, the one side that has all the design on it looks really good, and it kind of, and it does kind of look like the, the actual uh, invisibility cloak. So it's cool. I like it. I, I think a lot of Potter fans would have fun with it. So um, yeah, I guess I would recommend it. It, it all really depends on, on your, um, on your pockets and how much you want to spend on a, uh, on a toy that may only be fun for like a weekend or a couple weekends. And, uh, but if you're looking for just a dumb fun thing to play around with, I think it's, I think it's pretty cool. Like I said, you can do this same effect with some pretty simple uh, other software. So um, it's one of those things that, do you wanna put in the time to do it or do you wanna just have the easy way out? This is the easiest way out. You can record on the app um, for like a bunch of time, which I've been recording like this whole time. Um, and you can you, it just, it does stuff and it and it's fun and it works. So yeah, I guess I would recommend it. Full disclosure, we, we don't get any sort of uh, commission from this company or anything if you guys do end up buying um, any of these products we just uh, we just got them sent out for free so we figured we'd show some of you guys because we know that you guys are harry potter fans and so are we and i was super excited about getting this because they said they were going to send out some stuff to us but they didn't tell us exactly what it was um but they did mention the cloak and i was like oh i really hope we get that cloak because it looks cool there you have it if you guys uh, want to go check that out if i remember i'll put a link down below if not it's a uh, wow stuff is the people that make it so um go check it out it's pretty dope it's pretty dank it's pretty bomb. It went old school there. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to check out some of the other ones. Check out the unboxing when we unboxed it. If I again, if I remember, I will put it up there, but I probably won't remember. So uh, thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video, and uh, bye bye bye. <laughs>